perfect. Hey baddies and welcome back. Today I have of course another wig review like I know I said I was going to try to lay off the wig reviews, but honestly, I can't complain. I'm so grateful for the companies that continue to reach out to me to promote and review wigs for them. Like, I will never, never, ever, you know, decline that. I'm just going to have to make space for everything that I want to do on my channel. So I was sent this wig by Sam's Beauty and this wig is by The Stylist. Now it's crazy because I completely forgot about The Stylist. Like they've always had really cute wigs and I don't know why like I just forgot about them. <laughs> I did have I think a few of them probably the Curlicious one and one of the other ones I can't remember the style name now and I used to wear it in that blue black color that they were like famous for. I decided to go with this one and it's called Tasty. Now I didn't really see any reviews on this and the the picture like the the, the picture um on the website and it kind of just was like I didn't I didn't know what I didn't know what was going on <laughs> like it was just the the style was con confusing me the style was really confusing me but I was like you know I want to try this one because I've, I've never seen any reviews on it and it kind of looks like it could have some you know some type of potential I recorded a clip of what the wig looked like when I took it out of the pack but it pretty much looks exactly how it looks on the stock card I don't understand what what style they were going for like what is that what what is the flip like it ugh. listen the style of the wig i don't get it and it just didn't make sense i'm like the stylist i know the stylist has really good wigs most of the time so i don't understand what's going on with this one so i was like you know what i'm gonna try i'm gonna suck it up and try it if it's a flop it's a flop this fine but i'm gonna try it so yeah it comes with a 13 by 6 pre-plucked hairline it's the brown lace which was a major plus for me you guys know i don't like that white lace i decided to get it in a 1b because the colors the specialty colors on the website just didn't really it didn't it, it wasn't tickling my fancy i just didn't understand it i just decided to stick with a solid color because i just didn't i didn't have the time if you guys click the link you guys will know exactly what i'm talking about it came with the right side part you guys know i don't like right side parts i like left side parts i didn't record me styling the wig just because um this is the wig that i wore on valentine's day i didn't really have time to film while i was getting ready and i've had the wig on ever since so it's going to be what is today i'm filming this video on thursday so it's been um like a good five days that i've had this wig on i'm just gonna explain to you guys what i did all i did was i sprayed my lace tint you guys know i've mentioned this in like my previous two videos this is the lace tint that i use now and i use it in the color medium dark brown because like i said most of the wigs that i get the waist the waist the lace is really white and you know I don't like that. So I'd rather go with a darker lace tint and then I just don't have to spray as many layers. And then I flat ironed those flips out of it. So this is what the ends look like now. They're straight now. Like I don't have those any flips and I flat ironed it out, which took like five minutes. And so it does take heat. It doesn't say on the stock card what's the highest temperature, but I flat ironed mine on 350 and it was fine. So after I flat ironed out those things, I just use my flat iron to uh, switch my part to the left side and flatten it. And then I literally, I use my wax stick as well to, you know, lay the, this area flat. I literally took two bobby pins and pinned the hair down behind my ears. And then I did a few baby hairs and that was it. It's just simple. Like this hair, it really surprised me. Like I said, I've had this wig on for the whole week. And I'm probably just going to continue wearing it because it's, like it's very low maintenance 
it's very low maintenance i really had no issues with this wig at all it does shed a little bit but i feel like i've had that shedding issue with my previous the stylist wigs on a scale of one to ten the shedding is probably about a five or a six so for some people that could be excessive for me i don't mind you know i do not care about shedding unless it's crazy out of this world and it's not it's the perfect length it falls like just above my butt so it's probably about an 18 or 20 inch probably 18 and it still flows like it's not stiff i don't have any issues with tangling either the only place that it tangles is like around the nape area so that usually happens with wigs it did come with baby hairs at the back and i'm not sure why it's not like a 360 lace where you could wear it up i mean maybe i guess like if you wanted to wear it in a low ponytail or something i don't know i don't know why it came with those and the baby hairs at the front were too long as well like you could kind of see it sticking out by my swoop area because i didn't like i said all i did was pin it i did not like uh spray it with anything to harden it or keep it in place you guys could do that if you want to but i really just don't feel like it's necessary i would definitely rate this wig a, a strong nine nine and a half oh my gosh i forgot to mention this wig is 100 percent big hair friendly how did i forget to mention that that's like super important for us big headed people it's very important i'm gonna link everything down below i think the wig retails for 39 dollars $39.99. And yeah, I definitely recommend getting this wig. It's perfect. It's holding up really well. I have not taken this wig off since I put it on on Sunday. If I'm forgetting anything, please comment down below and ask me and I will be sure to respond to you. I'm linking all my social media down below so you guys can follow me. Don't forget to like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe. Join the baddie gang. Yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.